And how do you do that? <clears throat> By having confidence in yourself. This is tricky. It's hard to have confidence when everyone is telling you that the statistics are stacked against you. It's hard to have confidence when perhaps the world has made you feel worthless. But I have a few secrets to tell you guys. Number one, you have so many natural gifts and talents. I can feel it in this room. You're intelligent. You're beautiful. You're artistic. You're expressive. All of these talents that perhaps have been suppressed by all of the negative energy that is often associated with our backgrounds. And number two, in addition to having all of these natural talents, you have special gifts. You're special. The adversity that you have experienced has made you unique and special. You actually have special gifts and attributes to give to the world. Why? Any thoughts as to why? This is the professor in me coming out. What is so special and unique about surviving adversity? It makes us stronger. It makes you stronger. And how could you take that strength and apply it to any dream, any career that you wish to accomplish? Um, by motivating yourself and pushing yourself harder to do what you want. Exactly. When some of your peers are ready to give up, you can rely on that grit, that strength that you have been relying on up until this point to push you over the finish line. Okay. Anything else? What else about this experience makes you great? One more. Yes. Your ability to empathize with others. Your ability to empathize with others. Do you know how incredible that is? Do you know how it's lacking? I mean, you can see it when you watch the news, yes, right? Your ability to empathize with others and help others. So, let me leave you with this.